Hey my dudes, it's time to color in the toxic snail. Starting of course with the kneaded eraser to pick up all that excess graphite and using my lightest gray marker to kind of block out some uh, shading. This snail is taking me a little bit out of my comfort zone because I'm going to be using colors that are a lot more bright than I'm accustomed to using. And I was really counting on my inking style to bring it all back down. But not too far down, you know, I think toxic and I think, you know, bright colors and poisonous things and my ex, that last one doesn't help me any, but the other ones I felt like bright color was somewhat necessary. And here we finally get to see if my inking style is going to tone down this bright color scheme a little bit. Honestly, I think it works out. I think the whole thing looks very graphic and interesting. All right, is it just me or is it just painfully obvious that I'm not doing this voiceover with a script? I usually script these out and I just didn't have time. So now we're just stuck with me saying things until the picture is done. Here it is. It's so cool. I really like it. If you made it to the end, thank you so much for watching. Hope you like the little guy at least a little bit. He means well. Later, Tater.